What's up guys, welcome to Kieran's videos. Today I came up with a Fortnite game concept um, that I'm going to be showing you today. I've got an example of it um, near the end of the video and also I'm going to be explaining all the rules and everything to come with the game concept. Um, so maybe this could be added into Fortnite as an LTM one day, but I very much doubt it. I just wanted to make this because it just popped up in my head and it's just such a great idea in my opinion. So make sure to smash that like button, subscribe to Kieran's videos and comment down below any other gaming or football ideas for me and my trust man future. But now let's get into it. Okay, so um, if you hear any like um, paper, like paper, like rattling like this, it's because I've um, written all of it down on a um, paper and I'm going to be reading it to you um, just so I don't forget anything because like game concepts or whatever, it's quite complicated to make just like that and just telling you all the rules and everything to come with it like that. So I wrote it down on the paper. So obviously the game concept, um, I haven't told you its name yet, but as you can see as the title, it's called Gone Fishing. Now, this is how it works. Or well, actually, let's just, yeah, let's tell you the rules first. So, for um, number one, you have to play this in playground. Um, so obviously there's a playground mode in the game um, so basically what I mean by that is just going to creative and then I have like frenzy farm, holy hedges, um, those rifts just go in there. Number two, you have to land at the Sweaty Sands beach. So if you didn't know Sweaty Sands is a point of interest on the Fortnite map. So land in Sweaty Sands and land on the sand right next to the um, green bit. You don't actually have to be on the sand but um, you have to be above um, above the sand or above or on the sand at all times. Um, number three, it has to be just yourself, so solo, um, for this to count. Um, so you can't have like a partner helping you or you can't have trios, you can't have squads, just you in that whole playground server, just you. I will allow this though, if you want a duo partner, or actually not a partner, if you want to do duos or trios or squads, um, then um, you will, um, you can't connect points, it just has to be your points, you can talk to them, whatever, but it has to be just your points. Number four, you can only use a fishing rod to play. So, um, no harpoon gun to fish, just fishing rod, just the, a fishing rod um, to play um, gold fishing. Number five, you only have 15 minutes to fish from when you land. So as soon as you land on that sand, you, that rhymes, um, as soon as you land on that sand, you have to immediately, um, you don't even get... Um, you have to, your time starts as soon as you land on the sand um, and you can get your fishing rod, um, whatever, from that time onwards. Um, where were we? Okay, number six. You can fish as much as you want until the 15 minutes are over. Um, so, yeah, there's no limits. Just keep fishing. I suggest, um, I suggest, um, what was I? Oh yeah. So I suggest you um, land at um, one of the houses, little houses on the um, above the sand. Um, hope for a fishing rod in one of those chests. Um, if not, go on that brown. You know that brown dock. Um, go on there um, or below it, and then there's probably fishing rods there. Um, so yeah, get that fi get those fishing rods and then just start fishing straight away. And also, um, yeah, I suggest going to fish holes because fish holes are you get a lot more fish from there, and the better the f and the more rare the fish, the more points you get, or the gun. 
You'll see why I'm, um, what I'm saying in a minute. Number seven. Once the 15 minutes have finished, tally up how many points you have in total. So after I've finished all the rules, which is just going to be in like, um, after I have two more rules, um, once fi- no, I have one more rule after this. Um, so yeah, I'll tell you all the points, um, all the point totals then. And eight, you get an extra 25 points if you don't use any fish holes. So that's the thing about fishing and fish holes. You might get more points from the fish, but do you want more points from the fish? Or do you guarantee want a 25 pointer? It's, um, you can, oh yeah, and I forgot to add this, but you can attempt this as many times as you want. You, it's not like, oh, this is the only one chance you're ever going to attempt this. No, you can attempt it as many times as you want. And by the way, this is not creative island. I'm just telling you rules and stuff that you can just go into playground and do yourself. Um, imagine Fortnite had this as an entity and that'd be insane. Um, but as I was telling you, um, the point totals. So, um, I'll tell you the point totals right now. So, ammo what is worth nothing. A small fry is worth one point. A great gun is worth one point. Floppers are worth two points. Um, a green gun is worth two points. Um, a blue gun is three points. Slugfish are five points. Um, purple gun is five points. A gold gun is ten points. And then the odds of this happening are ridiculous. But if you get a mythical goldfish while you're trying to go do the golden fishing thing, you will get a hundred points. Like that is so rare. If you get a, like it's a what I think I think it's a one in a million fish, um, or something crazy like that. So if you do happen to get mythic goldfish, um, in your in the gold fishing, then you are just so lucky. Um, but um, there's not a lot to say now. Um, but this is the Fortnite game concept. Um, I ma- um, I made this myself. I just it just popped up in my head like this morning, and I was like, let's make a video on it. Um, so yeah, I've done this. As I was saying at the start of the video, um, I was going to show you an example of the um of the Fortnite um of the Fortnite um game concept on fishing. I'm not just I'm not going to play the whole fifteen minutes. I'm just going to get a few fish and just show you what I mean in like the landing points, and you should get everything else. Um, so yeah, let's roll it. Okay, so unfortunately, um, the fishing rod isn't in Fortnite Playground, so we're gonna have to change a few rules up. I thought this would have, um, I thought the fishing rod was in Playground, but unfortunately it isn't. So let's change some rules up. So um, obviously you don't have to use fishing rod anymore to play because there aren't even fishing rods in Playground. So now it's only harpoon guns. Um, you have to use fishing rods and others if you didn't know if you're an, if you're at open water harpoons don't work there so you have to use fishing rods there's no bonus 25 points and also um, you don't have to land at the sweaty sands beach um, you just have to go um, you just go to a, another house um, just go to anywhere in the map um, get fu- get a whole inventory of harpoon guns then respawn go to sweaty sands um sand um and um, and you only have to start there you don't have to stay there you just have to start there and then as soon as you reach sweaty sands st- sand um with a full inventory of a um of um harpoon guns you um of harpoon guns you um the time will start and yeah
So that's it for today um i hope you enjoyed that um clip of the, or the example i hope you enjoyed this whole game concept and um before i peace out i do want to tell you that if you do play fortnite and you're trying this game concept um tell me what your score is in the points because i'm very eager to know what how many points you guys get I, I don't even know if it's easy or hard. Um, obviously, it's based on luck um, and time and time management. But um, if but comment down below if you want to see me attempt my own game concept. But anyways, if you have enjoyed this game concept, make to, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe to Kieran's videos. And comment down below any other gaming or football ideas for me and my dress man in the future. But without further ado, I'll see you later. Bye! I'm so sorry that this video turned out like this.